Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to delete your Duolingo account. So this will work on any mobile device, it'll also work the same on your computer. Because we won't be using the app for this, we'll just be using a web browser. So first of all, open up a web browser, whether that's Safari, Google Chrome, Internet Explorer. Uh, then type in Duolingo.com. Uh, so basically what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to log in on Duolingo on your web browser. So click I already have an account, uh, just sign in on this, uh, type in your email and password. Uh, because you will need to do it on uh, the web browser because uh, for the app you can't actually delete the account. You can only do it on the web browser. So type in the correct email that you have for the account that you want to delete and then the password. Then you're going to want to click log in. And then uh, pretty much once, once uh, you uh, log in it will uh, come up just for like, the Duolingo page kind of similar to how you see it on the app. Uh, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to type, uh, click on the bottom right hand corner with a little uh, woman's faces. And uh, that's going to bring up uh, kind of like your profile settings area. Uh, it always says your name and stuff. You're just going to want to scroll down on here. And you can see settings. Click on that settings button right there. And it's going to bring up your account settings. Uh, so then you're going to want to scroll down uh, as far as you can. And these things you can see it says delete my account. Obviously you're going to want to click on that right there. And it's going to load up, take a few seconds, and it'll say this Duolingo drive through thing. You can access your personal data uh, by clicking the button, etc., like that. Uh, this can take up to 30 days, as you can see for that. And at the bottom here, it says Erase Personal Data. That's the one you're going to want to click on right there. So go ahead and click on that, and then it'll say uh, thank you for letting us know. And then basically what's going to happen is it's going to send you an email uh, for this by You're going to have to go to your email, so for instance, like your Gmail, whatever email account you have. Uh, click on that email where it say like uh, Duolingo personal data erasure request confirmation. You want to go to that email, then uh, scroll to the bottom of the email. Should be like uh, the big long link uh, where it says like drive through Duolingo. Uh, you basically you're gonna want to click on that uh, that link right there. Then it's gonna bring up uh, like a web page saying that you've uh, uh, done it. So as you can see, click on the one I uh, shown on screen there. Open up in uh, your web browser, and I'll say here Duolingo drive through erasure personal data confirmed. That's saying like you've been confirmed, you would like to have your account deleted. Uh, it will take like a, a certain period of time. We have like a seven day grace period to decide whether you want to delete it or not. Seven day process, then uh, your data will be uh, take up to 23 days uh, to get, uh, and then basically we get an email when you're finished. So it's not like an instant deletion. It will take a long time, uh, like around about a month to for the whole process, etc. So then that is the thing that happens. This is the way to delete the account if you want to. So leave a like on the video if that did help you out and you're going to go delete your account. Subscribe for more videos like this. Click on the screen to see more how-to videos on Duolingo and other apps similar. But that's it for now. I'll see you on the next video.